So I found this crazy little tutorial of rainbow cake sushi. I think it's gonna be a disaster. Which is it, a cake or sushi? I think it's cake in the shape of sushi. Oh. I'm so excited though. You know I think this is gonna be so good. Let's get started. So what you're going to need is some white cake mix, some vegetable oil, water, eggs, and sour cream. Also, you're gonna need some frosting, Cool Whip, food coloring, and sprinkles. So, so let's get this started. started. So the first step is you have to preheat your oven to 350 degrees, which we've already done. So next, we're going to be taking our six eggs and cracking them into the bowl. Sure. Don't get shells in it, we don't want it crunchy. We don't want a crunch roll. <laughs> so I'm gonna add one fourth cup of sour cream. And I'll add the cake mix. Okay. This one. Oh. Dump it in here. Got and then we're gonna do one fourth cup of vegetable oil. Oh, that, that is a lot okay. of oil. Okay. And then the water. So I'm going to beat the eggs now for five minutes. So wish me luck. <laughs> Oh gosh, please be careful, please be careful. I think that's too fast. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. So this looks pretty good, good job. So let's just add in the cake mix now. Okay. Whoa. I love batter. Oh. I made sure to be very well to make sure there's no lumps in there. And now we are gonna take some cake batter and put it on these separate bowls and add food coloring. So we're gonna take half a cup. So at this very moment, I have this feeling that it will work out. The only thing that has me like, what the, like is, this, out. is this sour cream for sure. Yeah, definitely. But, but batter like, you looks don't great. taste it in the no, batter, yeah. like you don't taste but it. But the out. batter looks great. Mm -hmm. So we just have to get the colors right and then we'll be good. Mm. How does it taste, sister? So good. Mm. I, could be, I could literally eat all this bowl. All right, so now that we placed our cake batter into separate bowls, we are now gonna add some dye, right? Yes. So you wanna do <laughs> red, orange, yellow, and I'll do green, blue, purple? Yeah, let's do it. Alrighty. One, five, we have to do five jobs. Okay. Three, four, five. Okay, there's the green, the blue. We're just gonna keep on mixing these up and try to get the color that we really want. So now that we put our cake batter into these cute little bags, we are now gonna pipe it into these pans. So next we're going to be snipping off the ends and start piping. <laughs> Pipe it up. Okay, it has to be very small. And you gotta make it at an angle. Yes. Okay, this is looking awesome. I don't think this is gonna work. I really, yeah, this is not gonna work. What about you, Shani, what do you think? I don't know, I don't wanna like, you know, say it's not gonna work, cause what if it does work? But I'm having a good time. Oh, mine are so runny. So now that we're done, let's place this in the oven for about 10 minutes and just see how we did. Mm -hmm. All right guys, so we just took out our cakes and uh, now we just put it on a kitchen towel that's lightly powdered and we're just gonna like roll it so it can get that like sushi effect. Yeah, mm -hmm. and mine, was in there for too long and just burnt. But Shani's yours looks so good. Thank you, I'm kind of surprised. Okay, let's try to roll this. Okay. But don't break it or anything. Uh, All right guys, so now we're gonna let our cake set like this for 30 minutes. Yeah. So now we're just gonna add our Cool Whip into the center and start rolling it up. Woo. And if you guys are curious on how we made this, all we added was some sprinkles, Cool Whip, and some frosting. So I'm gonna add a lot of sprinkles so it's picture perfect for Instagram. Kind of matches your Instagram theme. Oh, the yellow. <laughs> sprinkles just make everything better. I mean, Honestly. we finished all of those. All right, mine just seems to just be breaking by the second. Oh, <gasps> mine looks like a burrito. Really good. Yeah, yours kind of does. They kind of look like what burritos. What kind of though. sushi roll is this? Okay, put it on the plate, put it on the, put plate, on the plate. plate. I'm just trying to see. Honestly, this really had potential. Like, I saw it. Wow. Good job, Shani. Wow. Thank you. I love rainbow stuff. This is so cool. And honestly, they don't look that bad. Mine looks pretty bad when it was laid out. But now like this, it looks pretty good. And I'm just yeah. right about ready to taste it. Now the real test, the taste test. It looks really cool, but we're gonna see if it tastes really good. Yeah, let's put it to the test yes. and see. Ooh. Oh my okay. gosh, that looks so Jeez, good. Thick. Cheers, cheers. Genie, <laughs> cheers. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm -mm. 
I'm a fan of like cake and stuff, so I like it. I really like smooth as well, but this just wasn't, no, this just wasn't for me. I guess I'm taking both of them home because okay. they're so good. This is a DI dope for me. And this is DIY for me. But let us know if you guys would try this at home and make sure you subscribe to Awesomeness TV. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye.